Hello and welcome to Enyo Pool's how-to guide section. In this video we will be discussing how to replace a pool light fixture. This guide shows you how to determine if you have a bad light fixture and, if so, how to replace the whole fixture, including the wiring, to the fixture. Determine if the light fixture is bad. If your light continuously trips the GFI circuit, there's a good chance that it has developed a short in the light fixture or wiring. At this point, you will have to replace the whole light fixture and wiring. If you have two lights tied together, then you will have to wire each light independently to test which light is tripping the GFI. Before working on your light fixture, be sure to turn off power to your lights at the circuit breaker. Locate the power junction box for your lights. It will normally be next to the house, close to the pool control box. Open up the junction box and disconnect the wires to your light. You may have several light cables coming into this box. Generally, they are all labeled on the PVC pipes. If not, you may have to disconnect each independently and turn the power back on and off to see which cable powers each light. Mark the pipes for the future. Once you have determined which cable you want to pull out, attach a cord or special fish tape to the wire. One way to do this is to bend back the white and black wires to form a loop. Leave the green ground wire out straight. Then attach the cord through the loop. The green ground wire will parallel the cord as shown. Tape the wire connection on both sides of the joint so that no wire ends are left exposed. A smooth connection will move around any bends in the pipe more easily. Remove the light fixture off the pool wall. It is generally secure by one screw at the top of the light fixture. Pull the light fixture out of the niche. You should have enough excess cable to be able to lay the light fixture on the pool deck. Note how the excess cable is stored in the niche so you can replace it the same way when you install the new pool light fixture. Pull the light cord out of the pool wall. There is a conduit between the pool and the J-box at the house. When you pull out the light cable at the pool, you'll be pulling the cable out of the conduit and pulling through the cord that you attached at the other end. As you are pulling cable on the light fixture end, have someone else feed the other end of the wire and the attached cord down into the pipe. After you have pulled out all the old cable, you will expose the connection of the cord and cable created at the junction box. Once you have pulled the old light cable out of the conduit, take off the cord that was pulled through with the old cable and secure it to the free end of the new light cable. Pull the new light cable back into the conduit by pulling on the cord at the terminal box end of the conduit. Have someone feed the cable into the conduit at the back of the pool niche so that it doesn't bind as you are pulling on the other end. Pull the cable through the conduit until there is four feet of cable left at the pool side. This extra four feet will allow you to place the light fixture on the pool deck when you have to service the light in the future. Position the new light fixture in the niche by first recoiling and storing the excess cable. Then push the light fixture back into the niche. Replace the single screw to secure the pool light fixture to the niche. Go back to the J-Box end of the cable and cut off the extra length of cable, leaving about seven extra inches. Use wire strippers to strip six inches of the outer cable casing to expose interior wires. Strip about one inch of wire coating off each wire and attach the cable wires to the appropriate wires in the J-Box. Replace the J-Box cover and secure it with the screws removed in step three. Turn the power to the lights back on at the breaker box. 
check the new light at the pool to see that it is operating properly. As always, please remember to visit us online at www.neopools.com or feel free to give one of our experts a call at 1-877-372-6038.